collaborating with students allows me to continue my intellectual development because I can't do the research by myself. I need collaborators to carry it out. So uh, it lets me keep developing as a scientist and, and pursuing a research agenda. And then I think to balance that, there's the, the great part of helping to develop students into scientists and researchers. And students who work with me are the ones I stay connected to over time. And it's, it's really fun to watch their uh, their trajectory as their careers develop. And uh, we can think about what we did together as, as researchers and how it's led them to do different things. For me, I think I've gotten two things, well, obviously more than two, but two major things from it. And the first is just hands-on experience in a lab. You don't get that by just general lab courses. You don't get the feeling of satisfaction when something works or sad, you're sad when something doesn't work. And then you have to rethink what you're doing and maybe try a different route. So it's definitely a learning process that you don't just get in the classroom. And I think the other big thing is learning how to talk about the kind of work that you're doing and communicate it with other people, like going to conferences and writing papers. You don't get that from just being like in school all day. So being able to talk with other scientists and convey the information that you know and learn about stuff that they're doing that maybe you might be interested in pursuing in the future, it kind of gives you a well-rounded um, picture of the whole academic community. And just like Melissa was saying, I've also really enjoyed the opportunity to participate in these various conferences. And it's just been really um, informative to get to speak with other people in the field and learn about what they're doing and get more of an application for the chemistry that you're learning in the classroom. So, and I've also really enjoyed getting to meet former members of Dr. Vassell's research group, and it's just nice to see um, what they've gone on to do. Uh, just following up with what Autumn said is that uh, what I find really to be very rewarding is that the former students, the former students, and the current students, we form kind of a community together and. When we go to conferences, it's almost like mini reunions because former students who have gone on different places will come together and look at the students' posters and we'll chat for a while. And sometimes the former students will give the current students some advice. And uh, for me, it's the best way to form, I would say, more informal connections with students than the more stratified connection I feel in the, the classroom where it's really professor and student, this is more collegial. I would say.